everybody. Happy, happy, happy Monday. <laughs> it is Monday morning. I am Woofer Walker Jezebel of the Woofer Walker's Dog Services. And these are the woofers that I am walking this Monday morning. Um, yeah, you might think that, that you're like, why are they in the water? Well, I'll tell you why. It has been raining for, oh gosh, I don't even know how many days. It's been raining and raining and raining and raining and raining. And um, this is the dog park and parts of it is absolutely flooded and they think it is just great because most woofers love water and uh, these guys sure do, I gotta say. <laughs> so they are not upset at all about the rain. I think this is probably going to be, hey, come on, let's go. Baloo, shush, you're, you're a very loud woofer. Come on, let's go. Um, <laughs> Everybody's pretty crazy this morning. Um, they had an extra long ride here in the woofer wagon because, of course, with the weather and all the roads being flooded and stuff, we had to go really slow so that we don't hydroplane in the flooded areas on the highway. <laughs> Boy, are they having a good time. This is the best. This is what makes it worth coming out here, even in this horrific flooded stuff watching them just have the best times of their lives every single time they come out they have the best day ever the best day ever every time <laughs> okay guys come on let's go there's darla Woohoo! this way this way all right there's everybody so i should probably introduce everyone this is lenny lenny dubray he's an ex street dog very handsome young man this is Nebula Lee. She is a Pomsky, Pomeranian and Husky. That chocolate lab is London Van Winsburg. Uh, that's Ella, the little pit bull girl. Ella Summers Webster. Uh, this is Baloo. He's an Australian Shepherd. And there's Darla the Doodle, the Bernadoodle, the black and white curly girl. Bernie's Mountain Dog mixed, mixed with Poodle. And way, way, way up there is another brown one. Oh, she's doing her business. <laughs> Sorry about that, Rudy. That's Rudy. She's a Weimaraner mixed with a, um, oh, I always, I always stumble on it. Weimaraner and Vigela mix. I'll give her some privacy. Uh, can you clean that up for me? Thank you. Got to make sure we pick up our poops. Uh, and there's Bingo Le Joie, the doodle. Doodle boy right there. Uh, I think that, oh, Sadie, Sadie Koselmeyer. There she is. Sadie Koselmeyer, half Bernese mountain dog mixed with a uh, husky. That's a garbage can, Baloo. Don't worry about it. Come on. Are you barking at the garbage can? Such, such a puppy thing to do. Well, let's go investigate, shall we? Let's go investigate. You barking at that garbage can. You're keeping us safe from the garbage. Thank you, Baloo, for saving us from the, gar the scary garbage can. Let's go have a look at it, okay? He's growling at the garbage. Growling at the garbage. See, it's nothing. Come on, guys, this way. I told you, I told you it's just a garbage can, silly. Now I'll just put all my poop bags in there now. Look how much rain we have. It's ridiculous. Like the dogs are wading in water that isn't even supposed to be there. Hi. So I have um, more woofers than I want, than I usually like to take all at once, but uh, we are low staffed as Woofer Walker Trila unfortunately had to go to a funeral this morning. So I'm walking the nine woofers on my own, but that's okay. I've, I've got a lot of experience, not to toot my own horn, but I feel, I feel comfortable walking these guys all together by myself, especially since it's so rainy. We're not gonna run into a lot of people out here. So um, I think it's just gonna be a real fun, a real fun time. <laughs> oh, there's little London. Look at all this water. Holy crap, hey? Eh? Holy crap. But I'm, I, like I said, they are really digging it. They are just having the best time in this water. I took Ella's jacket off because uh, it was getting waterlogged. But she doesn't seem to mind. I brought uh, 
a warm sweater for her, just, just in case uh, towards the end of the woofer walk she gets a chill. Hi, Rudy! Hi, Rudy. Hi, London. These guys are crazy, aren't they? Bunch of crazy woofers. I'm just so happy that... Uh, that we can have so much of the park to ourselves due to the rain because these guys clearly clearly had a lot of um, energy that they needed to burn off and we needed we needed the space to do it without uh, having to get out of people's way a lot Ooh. hi Lenny there's Nebula Nebula in London having a play they love to chase each other those two as you can see, there's a lot of chasing going on. Totally uh, one of the most common play behaviors with, uh, with dogs, just, you know, loving, they love to chase and be chased. <laughs> Did you find a stick? Oh, I wouldn't hold on to that stick, Nebula. It's got thorns. Rudy, you got a stick? Did you find one without thorns? You did. Oh, good girl. Oh, that's not Rudy, sorry. Oh gosh. Sometimes I get Rudy and uh, London mixed up just because they're both brown and slim. But um, Rudy, as they get older, they're starting to look a lot different because uh, like I said, London is a chocolate lab and Rudy is a Vigila mixed with a Weimaraner. Hello, are you having the best day ever again? Oh, there she goes with her really good friend Lenny. Her and Lenny are always playing together. Where are you going, Lenny? I bet Lenny misses his best friend Brady right now. Brady is uh, Tuesday. Wednesdays and Thursdays, I believe. Today is Monday, so there's no Brady for Lenny to fawn over today. Probably good for him not to follow Brady every day. I mean, he's got to do some other stuff and play with other woofers, right? Good boy. Sorry, Bingo. I just don't want you grabbing and holding. Don't mind if they mouth on each other's necks, but I don't want them grabbing and holding. Nothing wrong with wild play when they need to get their energy out, but you got to make sure they're not like, you know, putting their teeth, sinking their teeth into each other too hard. Nobody wants a puncture wound. Rudy's pretty proud of that stick. Guys gonna go for a swim in the field? Can't believe I can actually ask them if they wanna go for a swim in the field. Crazy how much rain there is. <laughs> hi, hi Benj, I mean, oh, Bingo, hi Bingo. <laughs> that was deep, wasn't it? Yeah. And here I was worried a little bit that, that, that maybe they weren't going to have such a good time because of the rain. I don't know what I was thinking. I mean, look at this group. <laughs> they like it more. Hey, Lynn. is actually getting kind of uh, frozen from being wet and the cold wind blowing on it. So I'm not sure how long I can make this video, but I'm going to do my best. <laughs> oh, Rudy, you just make me giggle. You found a good stick, did you, ne or did you London? You're not eating it, are you? You're just chewing it, right? Come on, London. I don't want her to swallow the stick. Come on. Come on. Good girl. Good girl. Come on, uh, Darla. 
Hey guys, woohoo! Where are y'all? Oh, there they are. Gotta keep an eye on these monkeys. Make sure they know what direction I'm going. Yep, I've still got nine woofers in my pack. Like I said earlier, you know, normally we try to walk maybe six to eight woofers per walker, but um, yeah, I mean, Woofer Wakachula had to go to a funeral, so that's why I'm out here on my own. And that's just fine. These guys are great. For the most part, they're pretty good. They're just wild. Born to be wild. Oh my goodness, my phone is so wet, it's hard to zoom in and out now. Hi! Hi, does London have your stick? London and Rudy, playing with a stick together. The Bobsy twins. You know, I have to be honest, I don't even know who the Bobsy twins are. My mom used to always use that term, the Bobsy twins. I'm assuming it's uh, some famous twins. Bingo! No grabbing and holding. Good boy. Thank you. At least he listens. That's good. He listens. You find a good uh, a good tree? Good good bunch of grass to sniff. Goodness me. Where did those monkeys go? Woohoo! This way, kids! Woohoo! This way! This way, guys! Hi, Baloo! Good boy, Baloo! Good girl, Darla! Good girl, Darla! Good girl, Ella. Good girl, Sadie. What a bunch of good kids. What a bunch of good kids we got. Everybody here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, who's missing? Come on. you are. I knew it was you. Hi, Lynn. You looking for Brady, huh? Hi, Lenny. Good boy. Thanks. Thanks for coming when I called. Now we got everybody. Hi. Here comes trouble. <laughs> Woohoo! Bingo, where'd they go? Where are your girlfriends? Hi. Okay, come on. Hi, kids. That rascally Lenny doing his own thing. Huh? Come on, Lenny, this way. Oh, there you are. Good boy, Len. Thank you, Lenny, good boy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yay, everybody is accounted for. Oh, it's a wonderful day for walking woofers. Does anybody ever get the same problem I do when I'm wearing a cap and then I wear my, my hood over my cap, it kind of presses my cap down into my head and then I get like sore spots and a headache. It's a pain in the head. <laughs> I also forgot my rain jacket today, but that's okay. Um, I left it in the wrong woofer wagon this morning. But actually, I'm not cold, so that's good. Frank, 
anybody who's not familiar with uh, canine play, this is just play right now. Um, they're not fighting, they're just play fighting. But it is important to keep an eye on it because they are animals and they do have a fight or flight response. So when things get escalated and too exciting, sometimes they will, it'll turn into a real, a real, a real fight. So instead of a play fight, so you just gotta sort of make, keep your eyes really peeled as to uh, if anybody's taking it, hey, Ella, as if anybody's taking it to a, too high of a level or grabbing onto each other too hard. I think a lot of people that aren't familiar with us think that our dogs are a little under, out of control. But the truth is I've been doing this for like 20 plus years. And um, I like to think I know what I'm doing by now. Except, are you actually eating that stick? I really hope not. She, oh no, that's Rudy. Rudy doesn't eat sticks. She chews them, but I don't, I've never seen her actually swallow them. Thank goodness. Are you eating that stick or are you just playing with it? Rudy, let's get you a better one. Come on. Yeah. Oh, you didn't eat it. Good girl. Oh, good girl, Rudes. Hey. Look at that. Oh, Baloo. No, you don't grab tails. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Gonna have to watch Baloo. He can get a little overexcited. He does grab tails. He sure likes to bark. <laughs> Vocal, vocal guy. Again, again, Baloo is an Australian shepherd. Or sorry, no he's not. He's an Australian doodle. Why did I say shepherd? I think I said shepherd in the beginning of the video by accident too, but he's an Australian doodle, I believe. Half Aussie shepherd and half poodle. Boy, are they ever having the blast. The best toy ever. My goodness. All right, well. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Hey, 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 come on. Let's go, let's go to the back. Let's all go to the back area where we're actually allowed to uh, have all of you off leash at the same time, okay? Although there's nobody out here, which is why we're, why we're doing this. Oh, there's something on my lens. What is it? Did I get it? Let's go. <laughs> oh, Bingo's got the zoomies now. Hey, watch out, guys. They're calming down a little bit. And I still got stuff on my hands. There. So when you guys finally get all, a lot of your beans out, that's good. Ella is starting to get cold. I saw her sitting there shaking. I'm gonna turn off the camera in a little bit and put some dry clothes on her. My Baloo! I brought a sweater for her in case this happened because she already soaked her jacket. <laughs> All right, I think that's it for today. That was a pretty fun video. Take care guys. Happy Monday!